Hello, welcome back with me at Mr. Flat here. Yes, today I want to show you how many SS Pokemon in this game. And then, before we start to discuss about the SS Pokemon skill and review, right now I'm on the level 59 in here and my power already on 600,000 and my money and my diamond already on the 6000 so today i want to show you which skill and which uh ss pokemon that have a most useful area skill yes the first one is waiko this this pokemon i already have this is the only double s legendary pokemon that i have in this game uh, actually this one I caught from the gym quest and also from the any any event so I have the shard and chance it okay my Raiko in here already on the level 59 my Raiko is electric type also the attack type is the special attack and the nature is the breath Yes, this is the basic attribute for the Pokemon. So, this is matter for you to arrange your Pokemon team. As for me, I have a Raikou and also Pikachu for the electric in here. Electric in here. Okay. Yes, the attack type is special attack so it will be useful for the lethargic beast then the first skill of the Raiko is the lightning hit um, this skill already level 59 because I, I always enhance the skill uh, the first skill is only for the single attack target that's why the damage is high around 200% right now and the effect is will reduce 25 points of fury so the enemy that hit by this skill will reduce 25 of fury and then we move to the ultimate skill from Raiko this ultimate skill will be activated at the third turn so this skill also is area actually but I don't know uh, at one time it will be damage 3 pokemon at once but at one time also it only damage 1 pokemon uh, I don't know maybe it depends on the where the Raiko is put on our team so I suggest you to put Raiko in the middle because if Raiko use the ultimate skill and damage to the center enemy pokemon it will damage also on the row of that enemy so it will hit three pokemon i think i will do some research after that and then we move to the passive skill okay, the passive skill of the raiko on the fourth star is as attack plus six percent in here so According to the Pokemon Star, it will open the new passive skill because right now my my right for only four star. That's why there is only one new passive skill that already open. For the the five star, it will open the Geomancy that will grant you attack and as attack to all friendly electric. So it will give you. Uh, enhancement on the electric type pokemon and then for the six star yes raikyo raiko will give you increased team damage rate on five percent it it actually agreed with increment of the damage but it will cost you many shards to reach the six star that's around Right now, uh, maybe around 480 480 start yes because of Raiko right now 
is electric type that's also make Raikon need a power bank in here to get the spatial awaken if this spatial awaken is active every Raikon attack it will have a 70% chance that Raikon will use the first skill so actually this is a good thing but yes you know to buy um, Z crystal or the Pokemon equipment equipment it cost you too much point of arena or point of the what wild wild enhancement and next we move to Entei because I don't have Entei so I will review this Entei on the preview the Entei is the uh, uh, natural serious Pokemon with the fire type and have the potential power is 16 Entei is the same like Raikou on the end of the sequence and now we watch the Entei ultimate skill in here with the blue fair yes this one and Entei actually is cool man body full of fire and as we can see the Entei unique skill or ultimate skill is dealing a lot of attack damage to all enemies all enemies it will give the enemy 130% damage to all the target that getting burned by the blue flare and we move to the Entei skill Entei first skill Entei first skill is only damage to one enemy it will damage you at 119% at the first level I don't know if I get the Entei and make the skill on the level 60 maybe it will cost you more damage in here and also Entei passive skill increase damage to all friendly fire type so it will only increase on the fire type Pokemon same like Raikou that will increase electric type Pokemon power and then for the next passive is the enhanced mitigation rate the mitigation rate of the Pokemon will increase 5% and for the super enhanced attack will increase 6% so we will watch again the animation of the unique skill and play blue flare oh, it's so cool man so that's for Entei we'll try to review the other Pokemon again we will review about the Suicune because the three of them is three dogs that the legendary Pokemon on the Pokemon Crystal then Suicune the nature are also serious so between the three Pokemon Entei and Suicune have same nature Pokemon meanwhile the Raikou only the different one if we see the ultimate or unique skill of the Suicune is also area damage but it's only damage to three enemies and cause one enemy without evac and reduce 25 of fury so it will deal you 200% damage okay let's see the skill of the Suicune right now wow wow the icy with water uh, I think it's better animation on the entire yeah. and also for you to know it's a water type of Pokemon on the first skill it will damage only one Pokemon so Raiko, Entei, and also Suicune first skill is single target but only the Entei that have unique skill that damage to all of the enemy okay same like Entei and Raiko Suicune also the passive is increase to all friendly water type only so my suggestion if you uh, want to enhance Pokemon a uh, legendary Pokemon I mean better you think of the Pokemon your Pokemon information first 
as for me i didn't have any electric pokemon that have a uh, high power so that's why i picked raikou and beside of that raikou shard is yeah easy to find to enhance for the fourth star level and now this one is regigigas actually the regigigas is uh, can be find on the ssr ssr pokemon pack and also this Regigigas is a serious Pokemon with the normal type and the potential is 16 and then we see to the unique skill first yes Regigigas unique skill is only deal damage to the one target I think damage is too low right only 280 percent compared to the NT yes NT Reiko and Sikun I think this is lowest but I don't know I, I never use this and I never uh, battle with Regiga still now I don't know uh, the effect or the, 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 the what is that the power of that skill yes passive of the Regiga is impressed self damage during the battle and also on the passive skill level 4 it will increase damage team and increase the mitigation war increase pokemon attack for the super enhancement attack at level 6 hmm it's typical of the pokemon death buff for his self and now we are moving to the celebi Celebi is a grass type Pokemon with the gentle nature and the potential is 16 and the unique skill of the Celebi is Leaf Storm that will cause damage to 3 enemies with the 200% of the, of the attribute and then Celebi per skill only damage to Yes, it will cause you 119% damage to the single target for the first skill. Now we look at the Celebi movement. Then the new skill, oh, I told you it not skill, new skill, it the third skill of the passive Celebi. It increased mitigation to all friendly quest type Pokemon during the battle. So this skill will active only during the battle. Then the passive is increased the mag, mitigation rate. Ah, this one is ultra enhanced attack. Yes, this ultra status actually give you more one percent more of the increasement attack of Pokemon. Yeah. Between the Raikou and Taisuikun and Regigigas, I think the Celebi is the first one to have the Ultra Enhancement attack. So we move to the Zapdos. Zapdos is actually a legendary bird Pokemon. Zapdos is one of the three bird legendary Pokemon. Zapdos, Articuno, and Moltres. Yes, Zapdos is electric type of Pokemon. The nature is quiet and the potential is 16. With the ultimate skill, is Electro Wipe at 130% damage to all of the target enemies so it will deal you 130% damage to all the target and also for the first skill it also damage to all enemy with the 65% of the attribute that Zapdos have and it have 10% chance to one Pokemon to have paralysis Status. With this paralysis status, your Pokemon cannot move for the one turn, so it will help you at the battle because after Zapdos gave their skill, the Pokemon turn is over and next to the next Pokemon. So this is the wow, the effect of the Electro Wave are really very very cool in here. The lightning is come from the Zapdos body and they make to all of target in the area 
Zapdos Yes, the passive skill is actually increase attack and as attack to all friendly Pokemon during the battle. It will increase to 20 points and also increase team damage rate. Enhance mitigation also, yes. Of course, Zapdos have ultra enhanced attack Pokemon. I think it's only Regigigas and also the three dog that only have 6% enhancement on the passive level 3. The next Pokemon is the Mew. Mew is a Psychic Pokemon. The nature is Zoe. Potential level is 16. Yes. Actually, if you watch the movie, Mew is the legendary Pokemon, ultra legendary Pokemon that appear on the first team Pokemon. This Mew ultimate skill is Speed Up will release the weight energy and they make two Pokemon on the strike line and increase oh increase Pokemon 20% free wow it's a kill right oh. oh so the animation I think the Mew will strike forward to the front to inflict the two Pokemon and then the first skill of the Mew is only for the one Pokemon and the uh, passive is increase mitigation 0.04% to all friendly Pokemon during the battle also I think the other passive skill is same with the previous Pokemon yes also we'll try enhance attack in here okay I think that's for the Mew. If I see the ranking, most of the first rank for a uh, post rank trainer will use the Mew as the main formation team. Mm -hmm. And then we move to Rayquaza. Rayquaza is Dragon type Pokemon with the nature wave and the potential is 16. The ultimate for Rayquaza is they make to all enemies with the 130% they make to the target and if the enemy have the stun status enemy cannot use unique skill and last for two turn and actually this stun will have chance to wow to all the pokemon i think it's good to have white quasa in your team okay maybe at the at the end of this video, I will give you a suggestion or I will give you a... Um, what is that? Uh, my dream team on the last... the last review Okay, this is the... Ooh, ooh, wow, wow. Ah, Yes, the animation is too short, even the Rayquaza cannot show her ultimate skill and then we move to the Rayquaza first skill. The Rayquaza first skill actually they make 130% to 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 enemy Pokemon in the line. While the stronger Ranger immediately increase its own. Okay, so after use the skill Rayquaza it will increase and uh, oh increase they make to all. And then the three passive actually yes it's similar to the other. Now we move to Groudon. Groudon is fire type of uh, Groudon team is Crodon and also hmm, Kiarados. Uh, no no no. Groudon is Kyogre. Groudon Kyogre and also Rayquaza. The nature of the Gordon is jolly with the potential for the 15. And both Gordon I think they make 130% to all of the enemy. No. But they make two three Pokemon, I don't know. I think it's cost additional color. Ah, I think it's defect on this one so I cannot cannot give you uh, detailed explanation in here. 
then we move to Gordon for skill Gordon for, for skill will damage to oh three Pokemon actually they make in the back line and bite them deal attack damage okay I think it's area right it will damage to three Pokemon on the back line so it could to have Gordon on the your frontliner team. Okay, Gordon focus energy is increased. Oh, only increased self attack. And the other is same with previous legendary. Okay, we move to the next Lugia. Who else doesn't know Lugia as the main legendary Pokemon on the Pokemon first generation? Lugia, oh, that's two Pokemon is too strong at the first release of the Pokemon. Yes, Lugia is psychic type Pokemon. Lugia ultimate skill is only wow, only deal to one Pokemon. Wow. I think I, I will not use Lugia so we just only see wow this skill wow <laughs> as by far this is the most coolest animation skill of the other legendary Pokemon the first skill of the Lugia damage to two enemy Pokemon on the straight line and will cause 130% damage to the target and it will reduce 25 points of fury in the injury Pokemon out. so it will damage and reduce 25 points of fury in the Pokemon who hit by the Lugia first skill we move to the Lugia Quad skill will increase depth and special depth to all friendly sizing type Pokemon during the battle. Increase 0.06% only for psychic type friendly Pokemon. Okay, the three other passive is same again. I think the, uh, I, I will suggest to the administrator or developer to, in, to invest or to add a new passive skill for the legendary Pokemon. Uh, the next one is Ho Oh, Ho oh is a fire bird or a firefly Pokemon with the gentle nature in here and potential level is 16. Yes, the ultimate skill or the unique skill for the, from the Ho Oh is the charge milestone with Wow. This is, I think, this is the highest they make to all enemy that legendary Pokemon have. Even on the first level, the Ho -Oh will give you 150% damage to all enemy and increase 15% damage to all friendly Pokemon. So it's better to put the Ho -Oh on the front line, I think. And then also. First skill of the ho -Oh is the hunt 130% damage to 3 random enemy. Wow. Okay, I will make this ho -Oh to my team too. So, by far I have 2 Pokemon in my dream team. ho -Oh and also the Zapdos. It will be used on the end game Pokemon because in the end game of Pokemon will focus on the battle I think. Yes, the other passive is same, increase the make, enhance mitigation, and cool trying to add attack. Okay. mean this ho -Oh attack type is only not normal attack. So, we are moved to the next one, the Kyogre. The Kyogre is eternal enemy for the hold on. Kyogre is water type Pokemon because it looks well the nature of the Kyogre is quiet and the potential is 16 Kyogre unique skill or ultimate skill will impact to 3 random Pokemon with 220% damage 
and deal with special damage and reduce 50% special defense for 2 turns and 21 wall at the same time there is 20% chance to cause wound so enemy hit by this skill will have a flint status so the enemy cannot move after damage and work for skill it's only a 2 but only for 2 pokemon with the 130% damage to the target and also have a sleep for one turn oh it's good too but I will look for the next Pokemon and make a decision later either I want to have this Kyogre on my team or not focus energy increase self only okay the buff is for the self buff and the Kyogre type attack is special attack here We are moved to next Pokemon. Next Pokemon is Virizion. The Virizion right now is still on the event, so if you want to have this Pokemon, I suggest you to uh, participate on the event and buy a uh, recharge diamond because I think the skill is very good. When the ultimate skill is they make 130% for all of the target, and the target have 30% chance to be bound. Enemy in the bounce status cannot dodge, which means if the Pokemon on the bounce status, your attack never be missed and also have a chance to hit by the critical. Also, increase one random align to the war, which means one of your six Pokemon will have a chance to release their unique or ultimate skill twice on the five turn uh, first skill is cast blade of leaf on round three target and the last the injured target at 20 percent oh i think this region will join my dream team because the first and the unique skill is area type which i looked at it for one defense terrain will increase less sure this, this pokemon will join my dream team Virigion. so right now we have three Virigion, Pokemon and also Zapdos and then the passive skill of the Virigion is different from the other it super enhanced SP it will increase HP 6% wow it's a good amount of HP increment in here right and also this is press type hmm, okay I have the dream team and the pokemon type is different too press electric and the fire you know and the next is the latias actually the latias have twin name Latios but I didn't find Latios in here only Latias so Latias ultimate skill or unique skill is burn hot liquid fire and deal attack damage on random three targets also increase three random lives 15% okay good but not so good for the ultimate skill We are moving to the Latias first skill. In here, Latias first skill is Dragon Fire. They make 130% to two random target and deal attack damage. Okay, but it means the Latias have attack type Pokemon. And we see okay, the coil is for the Dragon type Pokemon only. Oh, this one, this Latias also have the impressed Pokemon FP as for Kyrgyzion too. Okay, good. But we will see the next Pokemon. Either Latias will join my dream tomorrow or not. Okay, the next one is Palkia. Palkia is the eternal enemy of Yalda. The Palkia also Dragon type with the skill Special Ren. 
special win will damage 130% to all of the target wow it's good it's good i think palkia will join my dream team because it will reduce 30% defense and defense so i can and then for the first skill Valkyria will cost damage 160% to the target the target is or to target in the line reduce all enemy target wow this this Valkyria passive will be useful on the battle so I will make sure this Valkyria will join my team The other passive skill like increased training can enhance mitigation was also same. So we will see whether Valkyria has different six star. Wow, this one is ultra enhance every XP. It's more high than Trillion and the last yes, it will increase your Pokemon XP by 70%. Fire, Dragon, uh, Electric, and also Crest type. And now it's Dialga. Dialga is Dragon also. Nature Harpy, Potential System. Deal all target. Okay. Every Pokemon that ultimate skill to all of target. I will make sure it join my team. Okay. I think the area of effect for Yalga and Palkia is the same. The ultimate will grant you damage to all Pokemon, and also for the first skill will grant you to Pokemon damage. And the Dragon Solo, when HP is lower than 50%, increases attack and as effect for the ultimate to high 15%. 15% for the turn. Okay, I will make sure this Dialga will join my team. So, you know, I already have two Dragon Pokemon for joining my team. And then we will see who is the last Pokemon that will join my team in here. No, the Mewtwo. Actually, if you want to have a guarantee 6 star Mewtwo Pokemon. I suggest you to recharge diamond till you become to level 15 because on the level 15 the this game is will run you a level 7 Pokemon of Mewtwo. Then Mewtwo size 6 skill is the make to all enemy with 100 to but all but the first skill first skill is only for one Pokemon. Hmm, it's not too good Even if the unit skill is to all enemy, but the first skill is just for one people. Yes, for the defense battle, the area of effect by your Pokemon skill will have a higher chance of winning the battle. Player versus player. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, I think we will see the animation of Mewtwo skill right now. Oh no, it will. Give you a uh, confusion attack with the high ball of energy in there, but I think still now the best animation skill is for the Lucia. Mm, I don't know if the combat power of M2 is high, but for the skill, I think I will not use the M2 right now. 
after many consideration this is my dream team right now